you. Here are three things you need to know right now. According to a new report released today, nearly 3 million people filed for unemployment benefits last week. That means 36 million Americans have filed over the last two months, erasing all job gains since the Great Recession. There are new reports of high school students having trouble with online AP exams. Students began taking AP testing this week, but some say they ran into problems when they submitted their answers online and may have to retake that test in June. These exams are usually taken in person. However, the College Board announced earlier this year they would move testing online because of the pandemic. So far, the College Board has not commented on the reported issues of test submission. A rapid diagnostic test for the, co the coronavirus may be missing a large amount of positive cases. That's according to a new study from New York University. Researchers ran 101 samples taken from nasal swabs through Abbott Labs ID Now test and compared those results to a rival's test. Well, they found ID Now missed at least a third of positive cases using one type of swabbing method and nearly half when using dry nasal swabs. It's important to note that the study has not yet been peer-reviewed or published in a medical journal.